So it's been a long time since you guys saw a Halo 5 Guardians video on this channel. I knew I was long overdue for one. Hey guys, it's Mark Rums Guardian, and just welcome to some Halo 5 live commentary fun stuff. So, so guys, today marks, so maybe yesterday, marks the 16 year anniversary of Xbox and Halo Combat Evolved. And this is the place that they threw in Halo 5. Pretty much like Halo CE maps. Well, it is Halo Man Forward, but with Halo 5 uh, movement gameplay. But I mean, I was kind of getting a little tired of World War II. I saw this playlist was back into the mix. So I'm like, you know what? I'll play this. If you guys notice, I actually have the commentary just the same, but the game volume was actually turned down less. So, because uh, I noticed for the World War II video when I was editing, uh, there's some points the mic went like, really quiet but it was kind of awkward when i was editing i was kind of just getting upset when i was doing I'm like oh man i'm just making this i made these guys a crappy video i never knew realized this was this easy of a game mode especially when you have the ce pistol but it does feel good to play halo 5 after playing i think a little too much world war 2 that is definitely rage inducing i mean honestly though halo is just where i feel at home all the time it's just literally my favorite shooter of all time yeah, i mean the halo 5 you know, has some controversial gameplay with the newer faster gameplay but i mean i still enjoy it. i think it's very well i mean they execute the the quick gameplay very well but really guys the reason i haven't been making any halo 5 videos or just halo videos in general i mean the last one you probably see was a halo wars 2 awaken the nightmare campaign when you guys play as Atriox and well not Atriox but uh, I forget their name Vortus and Pavium there we go and I cannot honestly tell you the guys the last time you guys saw Halo 5 and oh there's a kill in Frenzy right there even though I stole that guy's kill like a dick but whatever I just realized we're beating these guys 22 to 4 like god like I'm just here just to play some Halo I'm commentating which kind of makes it a little harder for me but man right, I'm gonna get in this area just get like a nice tactical advantage yeah but really halo 5 is pretty much done in its lifespan I mean I don't want to say it's like done done but I mean they've been definitely updated I mean I know they uh Oh, nice. Hold on, let's take out this guy. Oh, that was clutch. That was clutch to get away from that rocket. Man. Come on! I was going great. I did know recently that they've been really tinkering with the weapons. I mean, the assault rifle is different now because when you guys check, like, look at the reticle. It's much smaller. I mean, you could just tell. I know they uh, increase the fire rate, uh, but um, I know that's one thing. They increase the... The accuracy, but the range has been greatly reduced, so that's really good. I know the BR has been messed with also, so I'm not really sure all the fixes I made. I did know it when I put a news video up, and oh my god, my aim! Jeez, what, what happened there? Like, literally, I was having a great aim, and then it just went to crap there. My real downside of this game was just the campaign was just kind of just, well, lackluster, pretty much, and that also the multiplayer was not complete at all basically at launch it's not even bare bones it didn't really make me wonder how am i how people will look at this game maybe like another like you know at five years or maybe like 10 years from now like are we gonna like look at halo 5 and actually like think or change our minds of kind of like we did with halo 4 or we just kind of like look at the same or even worse me personally this is probably my second favorite halo multiplayer just behind reach but if you guys really want to just, and see more halo 5 videos you know tell me i might be able to do some more stuff i mean Probably not, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to reboot the Wars on Wednesday series until maybe like Halo 6 comes out. And trust me, I bet you money Warzone will be back in Halo 6. It'll probably be changed up, but it definitely will be in Halo 6. Because I think it's a great idea, but they just need to execute much better. So I know for all you Wars on Wednesday lovers, it will be back once Halo 6 re releases. And I do not know when it will. I am making predictions, okay? So here's my predictions for when I think Halo 6 will release. Okay, so maybe late next year in late november maybe early december or around maybe at the earliest like february or january 2019 i know that's kind of a little odd but i know halo wars 2 came out then or then just fall of 2019 which probably is the most which is probably like the best bet for a release date for halo 6 think of halo 6 right now i mean there's a lot of things like halo 6 has to do i mean halo 6 is gonna have to heal the wounds of like what halo 5's campaign did and just all that just kind of a mess really what it was but the one thing we do know that good about halo 6 so far it will focus more on the master chief also there'll be split screen so you know there's some good couch co-op once again and you know it's just always good to have split screen because you know why not now, i don't know what's worse right now halo 5 servers or call of duty world war 2 servers no i think call of duty world war 2 servers are just pretty bad i mean i still just take a long time to get out of the game or just there's so many glitches so many Overall, though, I've been enjoying World War II a lot. I mean, I have to play more of the campaign because I know you, you guys probably did just see Episode 5. That was probably the last one. Though. This is coming out before. I don't know when this will be out, this video. Who knows? I'm just making this um, right after I uploaded the Episode 5 video. But really, for World War II, I'm mostly playing the multiplayer because it's really fun. But 
I kind of do suck at it sometimes. Um, it's actually a very hard Call of Duty. I don't know why, I cannot remember this map back in Halo Combat Evolved. I mean, I, I definitely recognize the name Chill Out, but I don't know, dude. It, it just, I can't think of it. What? Wow. Kind of one thing I don't mess with a Halo, though, after camouflage. Okay, I haven't told you guys yet, but I will make the announcement, I guess, right now, because we're playing Halo and why not. I actually did order another loot crate. The loot crate that I ordered, which is called The Great Journey, which is based around the events of Halo 3. I'm actually very excited for this one because so far, um, the Icons figure is actually very awesome. But I'll throw a picture of the Icons figure here. It's actually a Halo 3 Master Chief in his Mark VI armor, which is looking very nice. I don't know why, just using this this Combat Evolved pistol just makes me in the mood just to play some old Halo games, it's like especially like Halo 2. Wow, gotta love Halo. Also, another thing we know for sure in Halo 6 that's coming is black undersuits. Thank God. Black undersuits aren't bad looking, I will say, but the armor just doesn't pop out as much. I mean, really, that's the thing that just, that's unfortunate about it. Another assassin, another assassin. Oh, thank you. Thank you, friend. I don't know if you guys know or not, but I actually do follow Minecraft on Twitter. I saw that they're doing like mine for Minecon 2017, like Minecon Earth, that they're actually allowing us players to pick the mobs this year. One of them I think actually is the cool. It's like a flying overworld mod. It kind of looks like a pterodactyl or just like a dinosaur thing almost. And wow, I thought we got the W when I got that kill, but no. Actually, the mobs that they're actually like showing us that like, I guess like you could vote for only one and they only pick one out of the four, but that actually be in the game. The other ones that aren't voted in it are just scrap. Just thinking of Minecraft. I'm not sure if a new mob would actually like bring me back to like Minecraft, like playing it, like playing it, but I, I don't know. I mean, I love Minecraft, but it gets old every once in a while. I, don't know, I might try and get myself back into it, Minecraft, especially with that better together stuff, but I don't know. We'll just have to see. Hey guys, also by the time I'm recording this video, it might be up like a couple days later from now, but it's actually one week from now is Thanksgiving and it will be less probably by the time you see it. At this time of the year is kind of crazy because you kind of like slowly shift into the like Christmas season, which is, trust me, I'm already seeing enough stuff of Christmas this year. I'm like, come on. It's, it, I love it, but like, it, it's too early. It's too early for this. But yeah, just like about the holidays, I probably will be making a Minecraft Let's Play like Christmas special video. I don't know when we'll do, but I make those every year at least. Yeah, if you guys could really think of any ideas of what to do for Minecraft Let's Play, just tell me. I need to figure something out if I want to return back to that series. You know, Hang 'em High was just a very interesting map back in Combat Evolved. I mean, there's also a couple interesting ones, but this one's just weird. <laughs> weird. I think of Halo C, I just like just think of Red vs. Blue. I love Red vs. Blue, like the original Blood Gulch Chronicle. Those were the best. Stealthy SEAL Team mode. I'll sneak pack the defenses. Boom. Slug you. Boom. Slug you. Oh, oh, wait, here we go. Here we go. Oh! Oh, yes! There we go. One more, one more. Boom! There we go. We're nice. Oh, man! Oh, we're going in. Oh, my gosh. We're going in right there. Look at that. Beautiful extermination medal. I know some people don't like the medals in Halo 5, but I kind of like them a little bit. I mean, they're kind of a little bit more, like, just cartoony in a way, if that's a word you want to use. I know a lot of people like Halo 3 and Halo Reach's medals the best, which, I mean, I can't lie, they have some very cool medals, but, really, you know, I don't mind Halo 5's medals. I mean, they're just kind of more eye-popping in a way. Well, the Halo 3 and Halo Reach medals are just more heavily designed, which is very cool also. But guys, make sure to leave a like just for complete randomness this video was. I mean, I can also just title the video Randomness, which I probably won't. So guys, just comment whatever the hell you want down there. I mean, Minecraft, more Halo 5 videos, anything you guys want, just... It's yours to comment down there. You guys, make sure to subscribe for more just Call of Duty videos, Halo videos, and just whatever the heck this channel brings out for you guys. Like always, guys, have yourself a fantastic day. All right, guys, we must open up a gold wreck pack because to get that awesome armor and stuff. And oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I actually don't have that. I just kind of like process through my mind. And also, that's very cool. I'm satisfied. Oh, don't you just love microtransactions? The thing that taint our game, especially UEA. Don't buy Battlefront 2, kids. It's dangerous.